Let me be perfectly clear. I have never dealt drugs and never been involved in taking or dealing cocaine. This whole case was a horrific and disgusting entrapment by Mazir Mahmood and the Sun on Sunday newspaper. Mahmood has now been exposed by my lawyers openly lying to the judge and jury. These lies were told to stop crucial evidence going before the jury. This evidence showed that I told Mahmood's long-standing driver that I disapproved of drugs, which is the truth. It is clear that the driver was pressurised to change his statement to strengthen Mahmood's evidence and damage to mine. Thankfully, the lies have been uncovered and justice has been done. This case only happened because the sun on Sunday, Mahmood and his team tricked me into believing I was auditioning for a major movie role. They targeted me at a time when things were going badly for me and they had no mercy. Mahmood got me and my team completely intoxicated and persuaded me to act the part of a bad, rough ghetto girl. They recorded this and produced it as evidence when I thought it was an audition. It was a terrible thing to do. As my lawyer said at the outset, we have now succeeded in exposing the real culprits and most importantly, the real liar. As someone who has had my life ruined for the past year, I strongly believe that this type of entrapment should not be allowed to happen to anyone. I urge both police and News UK to investigate Mazir Mahmood and his team and to put an end to his deceit in pursuit of sensational stories for commercial gain. I have not been able to work for a year and I am now looking forward to resuming my career. I will use these experiences to make me stronger. I would like to thank all of the people who have supported me through this terrible ordeal including my fans and of course my legal team.